Ann from Author Nation. And today I'm excited to talk about a trend that has been booming and is going to continue to boom in 2024. And that's audiobooks. So they've been on a remarkable trajectory. And there are several reasons why you want to be paying attention to this trend. So first off, let's talk about the rise of audiobooks. So they've been consistently surging in popularity year after year after year. And according to the Audio Publishers Association, APA, I will drop that link for you in the comments or in the, pardon me, in the comments, in the description. You comment, I put things in the description. And that they revealed that even during the pandemic, uh, audiobook sales grew double digits. So why, why, why? Okay. okay, let's talk about multitasking and convenience. One of the driving forces behind uh, audiobooks is our lifestyle. We now want to be doing multiple things at the same time. We're driving and listening to an audiobook. We're washing dishes and we're listening to an audiobook. We're running errands and we're listening to an audiobook. We're working, we're listening to an audiobook, right? We're working out and we're listening to an audiobook. So we can't read while we drive, but we can listen to audiobooks. We can't read while we're doing household chores, but we can listen to audiobooks. So our lifestyles are pushing us toward wanting more audiobooks in our lives. I can take uh, 50 audiobooks on a hiking trip, but I can't take very many. Uh, real print books on a hiking trip, they're too heavy to carry. So that's the next reason, convenience, right? And portability. We want to be able to consume a lot of content. And when we are taking content on a trip or we're, you know, don't want to carry around a lot of content or books, we can have audiobooks. And some people might want to read ebooks and they equally fit. And that's another reason why they're an excellent trend too. But audiobooks are great. We can go for a hike, we can be somewhere, we can pop, um, we can pop our headphones in and listen. We don't even need the light to do that. So again, I, for example, I hike. This is why I'm talking about hiking. When I'm uh, hiking in the evenings and it gets dark, I can just pop my headphones in and listen to an audiobook, and I don't need to find a light or carry extra light to want to read in the evenings. And so they're really portable and they're really convenient. And they have a diverse audience. So as an author, that's one reason you want to consider doing audiobooks is a lot of people are listening to them. It's not just a specific group. Next, if you're interested in the environment, as many readers are, audiobooks solve a lot of problems around paper production. And so when we're listening to audiobooks, we are not uh, we are not dealing with paper. We're not trying to figure out what to do with a book when we're done with it. It's so much easier that way. And because of that, there's a like a sister reason to that. It's cost efficient for authors. You don't have to keep inventory. You don't have to have 10 audiobooks on the shelf. Now that audiobook, once it's a recorded file, it can just be sold over and over and over again. So it's actually really cost effective for authors once you've created it. And talking about that, uh, we'll talk about creating it. Nowadays, it's not about one narrator just reading the book. There's lots of different ways we take an audiobook and we turn it into storytelling, oral storytelling, through sounds, through narration, through multiple narrators. And going back to the cost effective, keep your eye out on AI and how that's going to fit into audiobook production in the future. So they're popular. The revenue is building. In fact, um, let me just get you a stat. Uh, audiobook revenue has increased by an impressive 14.3% year over year. So this underscores that audiobooks are one of the most promising high growth industries or sectors in the publishing industry. So do you have an audiobook? Is your book an audiobook as well? If not, consider creating an audiobook. If you haven't ventured into the world of audiobooks yet, you might be missing out. I encourage you to check that out.